guys, thanks for coming back to another one of my first impression videos. And today I'm gonna to be trying out the L'Oreal Double Extend Beauty Tubes Mascara. First gonna give my eyelashes a really good curl before I start with the mascara. And I just got the regular one, not the waterproof one. And basically the gist with this mascara is you've got the primer on one side and then the actual mascara on the other side. And I learned my lesson from a previous mascara first impressions video that I did where I had black eyeliner on and you guys didn't really like that because it kind of interfered. So today I don't have any eyeliner on and I'm going to start with the priming side. Apply step one to lashes and immediately follow with step two. No need to wait for drying time in between. So I am ready. Okay, I can already see that this primer step is really lengthening and thickening. And even just before the mascara, I can already see a difference. But I'm going to go ahead and put the ugh, black side on. I'm going to keep working that. I just feel like this is one of those mascaras that you can keep building. And it's not getting clumpy. It's actually doing a really good job at staying fairly defined. Wow, and it's super lengthening. I don't know if you guys can see that. I'm gonna go in with another coat and see how well I can build up the volume. Okay, so let's zoom in and see how this looks from close up. Okay, so I'm right up and really close so you can see. I'm gonna look down and straight into the camera so you can see the difference between no mascara and this side. Um, I do really see it lengthening. It's not holding the curl that amazing. Um, yeah, it is weighing down the lashes a little bit, so it's not really holding that curl that amazingly. It's not really doing a very good job at thickening them. It's more lengthening, I would say. It's very defining. Um, I could probably still work with it. I'm going to try now from close up to maybe add another coat now that it's dried a little bit and see how much this can be built up. So I can feel that it's dried uh, pretty quickly because going in with the second coat I can already feel that the lashes are a little bit they're starting to clump and I can feel that they're a little bit crustier but you can see they are it's a very defining mascara so I am be, like able to get away with putting on another coat once it's dried because it doesn't get really clumpy Let's try to use the tip this tip is awfully big on this brush, so it's really hard to get right in there and define, but there, I just did it. Can you see that? So, okay. It is incredibly lengthening. Um, I don't know how much I'm loving it at the moment. I'm going to go in with the second eye and be right back and then give you my final thoughts. Okay, so I'm back with both eyes done and I'm going to say that on this side I was able, I kind of spent more time at the roots to like lift it. So as of right now, it's, this side is holding the curl a little bit better. Um, the time right now is 3 p.m. exactly. Let me show you, that's actually funny that it came out to be 3 p.m. exactly. Um, but basically, I am going to see how this wears and holds up throughout the day. Um, I actually have quite a bit of things to do right now, and then I'm going to a basketball game tonight. So I will be back at the very end of the night just to see how this holds up. I can already see it's starting to kind of flop down. It's not really holding the curl that way well, and I think I'm going to have to add another uh, coat here to just make it match this one. I would say as of right now, it's an okay mascara, nothing to die for, um, but I am going to see how this wears throughout the night and how it removes. So I will be back at the end of the night. So I'm back and I really, really apologize for the lighting and for the way I look and for everything. It's really late. We just got back from the um, base, uh, basketball game that we were at. The time is 11.47 at night and I am dying to just take off my makeup. Okay, so the mascara looks very, how can I explain it? It makes my eyelashes look very, very sparse. Definitely lengthening, definitely separating. I would say not very thickening. Like it thickens each individual lash, but your lashes don't look thick, if that makes any sense. <laughs> not loving the final, final look. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not 100% sure uh, if I'm gonna end up liking this or not because sometimes you know it takes a few times until you start liking a mascara as of right now I'm gonna say I'm not loving it I don't think it's anything special it's fine I'll probably keep using it but as of right now I'm not loving it um, so so much by the time I upload this video if I have any 
further thoughts, I will leave them down in the info bar just so you know. Final test how easy it is to remove. So I'm just using my Gently Off um, by MAC. It looks like it's tough to take off, I think. Yep, this is pretty tough to take off. It is not coming off that easily. It's coming off like really, really flaky. And are those my lashes? Oh, I think those are like the little fibers from the primer. This is really difficult to remove. So I purposely just removed one eye and I've got to tell you, like, look how weird this is removing. It's like there's little flakes and crusts kind of all over my face. And if you look at the cotton round itself, look at that. It's just like little pieces and flecks and weird. Like I've never had a mascara come off like that. It usually just kind of comes off like black. This is like little, little chunks of mascara flaking off. Not an easy mascara to remove. I don't like that at all. And yeah, I'm not loving this mascara at all right now because this just kind of took it over to the next level, net level where if I wasn't really sure about its performance, I definitely don't like the way it removes. So I'm going to say I'm not really enjoying this makeup, this um, mascara for now. Like I said, if you do want to see my further thoughts after I've used this a few times and I have a little bit more of a um, definitive kind of absolute opinion about it, I kind of had a loss for words right there, look down below in the info bar and my further thoughts will be there. We will see you in the next video and let me know down below if you like these first impression videos and if this helped you and we'll see you in the next one. Bye!